Good afternoon, everybody. Balik mana karang yang esa makai cita bong jowo your solitary test roller in Nagoya Graveyard. To summarize about where this game is came from, I was offered to play this game by the author of the game itself, Greedy Gorgon from Greedy Gorgon Press, and. He was kind enough to offer me to play this, his uh, solo journaling RPG about working in the titular Nagoya graveyard, which is a real place in Japan. We have the picture here. See, if you search Google for Nagoya graveyard, you will find that the place is real. In this episode, we will continue the. Adventure of Suzume Akari. She has finished her first 12th day of working cleaning this place in the preparation for Open Festival. And uh, in these 12 days, uh, she didn't really encounter anything supernatural, and her response has been like unresponsive or yeah, not much, not much response, but that's okay. It's just what happened to her. Maybe if you play it for yourself, uh, you will find something different. So I'll put the link to the drive through RPG page for this game here on the corner, and you will you can check this game for yourself. But right now it's Obon and there will be a lot more visitors. Nagoyama graveyard will be busy. So the graveyard are prepared to accept visitors on the Obon day which will be busy. So for Obon we will roll on a new table chores during Obon. So Obon festival is the festival of the dead and to explain it's like a period where uh, the spirit of the dead are allowed to go back to this realm to visit their family. Something interesting about this Obon is the tradition to make a horse from cucumber and um, Elephant, I think, or no, a cow from eggplant, which symbolizes something. Uh, the horse is for uh, the spirit of the dead uh, to come back to their family quickly, and the cow, the cucumber, uh, sorry, the eggplant's cow represents so they will go back to the underworld slowly so they can. Uh, so their family and maybe the dead person can still feel each other but that is just the culture, the tradition, what they believe well it's fascinating but we will move on to the Obon rules there are different chores to complete for this brief period of time, ancestral spirits are said to be able to visit this world. Families who may have moved far away from the area return to the site of their ancestor graves, clean and maintain the grave, and leave offerings of food and drink for the spirits to enjoy. So this is uh, the foreign soldiers. I won't read this. I'll just put the cut uh, the screenshot of this in the screen so you can read for yourself so we will start with the obon chores it's similar to what happened in days before it's just that we using a different table and different dice except the reaction table we will still use the same reaction table so we will change this to a d6 and we will see 
what chore, what obon chores that she has to do on the first shift of day 13. Three, shoot the cat with increased vigor. So I think the cat it's getting getting more and more annoying, getting more and more I think agitated or something like that because yeah, maybe there's a connection between the dead with the cats. Maybe some of the cats can detect the presence of the dead here. So they have been more active in this time period. So Akari has to exert more effort to shoo them away. What the hell with this cat? <laughs> Stop making things more difficult to me, please. She's, uh, she said in her heart, in her monologue while shooing the cats with her broom. And we will move to the second shift. What will she do? One, a peculiar event. So for the peculiar event, it's uh, one and six. So what is the peculiar event for Obon? We will use D4 for this. So D4 is three. You find a tunnel. When she's chewing the cats, uh, she will stumble upon a corner and see a tunnel, a dark black tunnel without light and she will see that and her response will be let's see let's roll the d4 again to see her response two calm you find this event reassuring and become calmed <laughs> uh how do i how do i respond to this well i think uh seeing the tunnel and maybe she will think to herself like this. That must be the tunnel where the cat is coming from. I think I'll have to report this later. And she will go back to her chores on the third shift of day 13. Which is another peculiar event. And we will roll for the peculiar event. Which is 4. The faces on the statues in Stuba change each time you look at them. Oh, that's creepy. That is really creepy. The faces on the statues in the Stuba change each time you look at them. Maybe it's changed to the face of someone that she knows. Face of her parents, her father, her mother, or maybe her siblings, brother, sister, something like that. And her reaction will be unsurprised. For some reason, she is really, really tough. I think more like dense in Supernatural. She will just scrub her eyes and maybe thinking, ah, I've been in a bad term with them, with my parents. Maybe it's time for me to apologize or something like that. And she will go back to her work. And let's see, on day 13, she 4, there will be ensure the car park is orderly. So this time her work is outside the graveyard. She have to uh, help the visitors to park their car correctly. So it's like a parking man in Indonesia. I'll put the, the picture of them, one of them here. And that's it for day 13. So day 14. And for the second shift, and day 14 will be four. Organize the grave cleaning equipment, replace or replenish any missing stock. Yeah, like they said, uh, this is a new task for her. But uh, since she will, she has been working for more than two weeks already. No, this this day is uh, mark of her two weeks of work. 
she will already know where to put things and how to replenish replenish uh, the stocks the equipment so yeah I think it's not a big deal for her in an hour she will be done with that and we move to the third shift which is a peculiar event and what peculiar event will she encounter we will roll the d4 and see what we got two a cat become persistent in its interrogation of your life i think it's the same cat that talks to her the last time she will uh, the cat will like ask her a lot of questions so why are you working here are you are you really that dense huh hey i think i think after a couple of days you're working here your face looks a bit brighter hey talk to me i'm talking to you and her response will be unsurprised <laughs> i've been hearing things i think i'm too tired well i've been living in the stinking place i called apartment i need to clean them once i got back and she will shoo the cats and go back to her chores day 15 it's day before the last day and she will start to feel well tomorrow is the last day maybe i will miss this job i will do this next year maybe but for now i have jobs to do which is two help a family find their ancestor grave so like always when a visitor came she will bow deeply uh, and let uh, the visitors pass by before she before she get up from the bow but uh, this time the visitors will uh, instead interact with her ask about uh, her ancestor and she will help them locate the grave that they were looking for will it be difficult for her i don't think so but i think but she got one hour to help them so i think she will be succeeded and also maybe she asked for help from her co-worker so it, it'll be easier and shift three a peculiar event and what is the peculiar event this time i will try to use this day this time two a cat become persistent in interrogation to your life the cat is back the talking cat is back and the cat will still ask her questions and well based on her response i will uh maybe i'll describe what the cat is asking her so reaction two calmed feel calm after uh, she hear the cat talk asking question about her maybe she opens up a bit maybe listening like do you have a problem with your family maybe and it's touch a nerve to her and well looking at your face right now you're a bit brighter than before and maybe maybe you got the courage to go to them maybe well it's your your problem it's not mine and the cats this time the cats will leave her alone but she will feel calm after that and the final shift of the day on day 15 what she'll be doing a peculiar event and this event this time will be two the cat is back the cat is back everyone <laughs> the cat is persistent the curious cat 
And her response this time will be three. Curious. You are intrigued by this event. Explore further. Do not complete the next chore, but pursue this event. This time she will actually stop and talk to the cat. Hey cat, why are you so curious with me? She finally asked the question to the cat and the cat will answer. Now finally you respond to me, you talk to me after all this time. Well, to answer your question, you have this like gloomy dark aura when the first time you came here. And with that face that's so sad compared to all your co-workers, I'm just curious what happened to you. I never told to you though. How do you know that I have a problem with my parents? I have... Don't even tell my co-workers about that. Mm -hmm. That is just a pure coincidence, I'm just guessing. But are you really? Have problem with your parents? Yes. Well, I've been around in for a couple of years, and I think they they are disappointed in me because I, yeah, I think I know why they are disappointed because I'm not ready to move on from entering the university. So yeah, I think. They want me to move on, they want me to be better, to look for another avenue so I can live my life fully, but I didn't hear them. Yeah, maybe it's time for me to go back and apologize. That is a good thing to do. Well. Sky is already dark and it's time for me to go look for dinner. Are you not going home? She will uh, check her watch and yeah, it's already it's already dark. Well, it's been a weird day talking to a cat. Maybe I'm too delirious, but well, that calms me down. Thank you. And maybe. I'll see you tomorrow. That will be my last day here. Hmm. Last day, huh? Well, good luck. I'm not gonna miss you though. And the cat will run away. Damn cat. She chuckles and she goes back home. She will take a bath, rest, and this will be her. First shift of the final day. What chores she will have to complete? Two, help family find ancestors. That's easy for her at this point. On shift two, four, organize the grave cleaning equipment. Also an easy task. And on shift three, a peculiar event. And what is the peculiar event? The Obon peculiar events she will encounter on her last day will be <laughs> The cat is back My lovely cat Hey you girl And this time her response will be Her response will be Three Curious you are intrigued by this event and Explore for dirt, do not complete. So she will spend the rest of her days talking with this cat. And I think they talk about many things. Uh, the cat will ask questions. And she will ask about the tunnel. And the cat will say, That tunnel is a really special tunnel. And we cats. Always go uh, through that tunnel to a destination, uh, but human won't be able to pass that tunnel. Why? Well, because they can't. And why so? Because they can't. 
and they will repeating this more times until Akari finally give up and they will continue to talk and finally look at the time you know you really really makes me spend my time talking with you are you that sad when I left Mm, not really. Are you not sad we are not meeting King? Maybe. Not really. Are you sad? The cat gives the question back to Akari and Akari will say, Maybe I will, but well, maybe this is not such a bad job. I think I will come back to work here next year. Well, it's the last day of Ogun, and look up there. When she raises her head, she will see that uh, something like stars moving away to the sky, and on that stars light, something she can see a shape like the eggplant cow. Well, this is the last day of open and the spirits are going back to their place. So, yeah, I just hope that they find solace by visiting their families. And maybe you too. Yeah, a good idea. Well, maybe this is also things that I need to do. Reconcile with my family. Hmm, good girl. Okay then, are you going back? Yeah, the graveyard is almost closed. I have to go back before they lock me here. Hmm, lock you here, eh? It will be good though. I can accompany you. But alas, it's time for you to go back. And hopefully we'll, we, we will meet again next year. Yeah, take care of yourself. Bye. And the cat will turn and run to the bushes. Akari will stand and on the last day she will be scolded because she is disappeared from sight because of her curiosity. But then uh, Asahi and uh, her manager will say that she did a good job overall and the manager will give her a final task in the form of a letter. The city of Himeji requires an official letter of completion of a work contract to signify the end of your employment. This letter can be a simple few lines or not. It can describe your experiences or not. It can reflect on changes in your character or not. Please also remember to return to uniform washed and pressed. Kindest regards. So I will say that she will go back, wash her uniform, take a bath, and before she go to sleep, she will sit at her table and wrote uh, the required letter and she will say something like thank you for letting me work in this time period I'm glad I've been able to work here to meet kind co-workers and I can see that my life is worth living by working here and Personally, it made me want to take a step forward to better my life. Thank you so much for the uh, opportunity and also the uniform. Best regards, Suzume Akari. After she stopped writing, she will sit down, she will stare at the window of her apartment for a while. Her apartment is already clean and everything is orderly in her room. She will be thinking 
and then she will put her right hands into her chest, taking a few deep breaths. After that, she will take her phone, scroll on a name on the phone, father and mother, make a call, and put the phone on her ears. Hello, mom. Thank you so much, everyone, for watching until this point. Nagoyama Graveyard. This is actually my first solo journaling RPG. I've downloaded a lot of that title on itch.io free or pay what you want. But this is the first system that I've actually played. It was a fun and contemplative experience and I highly recommend everyone to try to play this for themselves. One thing that I like not regret just I I a bit disappointed is that I won't let me take the reaction number four which is untethered you gain an increased sense of unreality roll a d8 on the chore table and replace this chore with another peculiar event if you have already replaced this chore or if you roll an eight roll again so every time you got a four for reaction this will change one of the chore list which is a d8 chore on the first 12th day or the d6 on the last 4 day and what you roll will be changed to peculiar event so you will experience more and more peculiar events the more you play this game but that didn't happen in this session but that is also okay you don't need to get that peculiar event because there is no winning or losing in this solo journaling it's about what you experience what the player character experience in this moment and that is the story of Suzume Akari working on the Obon festival in Nagoyama graveyard thank you so much again once again for watching don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel for more solo playing and i will see you in the next solitary dice roll